feel like today's broadcast is brought room. to you by shop.spreadshirt.com backslash the hyphen gentleman's hyphen den for all your gentleman's den merch needs i gotta do it this way because we ain't got an intro song anymore what <laughs> so welcome back to the gentleman's den jeff frankie and sean back here again to to give you something to listen to on your way to work, I guess. Uh, to give I'm going to give you something. All right. We're here to give it to you. Yeah. To Go it. get. Uh, How is everyone? You guys look fucking fantastic. Let me just. Doing uh, great. Let me start I'm moving. That, all right? I'm in the middle of moving, so I'm wore the fuck out. Jeff's, Jeff's down to uh, paper plates and plastic cups. Red like, Solo uh, cups. <laughs> folding, uh, folding pizza. I couldn't even make a pizza the tacos. other day. I told you guys. I had nothing to cut it with. <laughs> if it was just for me, I wouldn't have cared because I would have just folded it <laughs> like a taco. But it wasn't just for me. So it had to get cut into slices. That's when you just throw it on the table and everyone gets to fend for themselves. I, 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 I said I was just going to throw it on the floor for the kids and let them fight for it. <laughs> like a pack of hungry wolves. <laughs> I mean, it gets it there. It's like a wishbone. You just fucking. <laughs> oh, that's great. But, you know, you got to look at the fucking 50 50, man. Glass half full. Like, well, you I got to be Sean into helping me move tomorrow. <laughs> what a sucker. Can't use the excuse, but there's a pandemic. Fucking loser. I know, right? You better wear a mask to my house, you fuck. You're the one picking me up. <laughs> got him. Yeah, yeah there's not much. I just, I just got a couple helmets. things, man. I need your guns. Look at the busting out of that shirt. Both your shirts. Oh, man. And two shirts. Yep. Look at that. Two shirts? <laughs> two Always shirts. Shirt, baby. Because the one underneath is ripped. Shredded. <laughs> I'm just ripping out of it. Look at that. How do you have a tan line right now? It looks like your arms are whiter. I don't even, it's like fucking winter. Yeah. It's a Dude, nuclear it winter. Fuck outside. How I, you get sun? I stay outside with no sleeves on. Let the wind burn. He's just hard. He's just, just like. Burnt. Weather in this kid. Just Maybe flexes and look at it. Just Go away, Tan. <laughs> the lighting. Oh, fuck. So tough. Telling you, everyone's lacking a little vitamin D, if you know what I mean. Wait, what? Yeah, it sucks. It sucks how dark, wait. how early. Yes. Dark. Bro, I, I can't wait for the dark, sun to be out till 9 o'clock dark. again. Every time I look outside, I'm like, fuck, it's like 7, 8 o'clock, like 4.30. Four. <laughs> yeah, I, I, go, I get to work and the sun's not up. I leave work and the sun's down. Dude, isn't that the, yeah. like the worst, though? Because you feel like you go six months without seeing That's the sun, the and you're just... I'm starting to really fucking break. Yeah. Just order a tanning bed, and it's... then you'll feel like you're outside oh, all the I... time. <laughs> I take plenty of vitamin D. Oh, I knew you. In capsule mm. form, right. you fucking weirdos. If you ever need a little bit extra vitamin D, you just let me know. You can't help me. I'll give you the what D. does that mean? You can't help you me. Can't help give him, are you going to give him the D? I'm going to give him the D. You can't help I got me anyway. You won't leave the fucking house. You have to get a hazmat Bro. suit out in an oxygen tank. Yeah, what are you talking, talking about? about? You haven't I left your basement. Of what the fuck are you guys talking about? I was looking I can, at the I videos. The so you haven't, you you haven't been to the gentleman's den in eight months. Who? Me? You. Our last... Podcast we all did together in the same months. room was eight months ago. Wasn't that That's the sad. Corona Harley Newer video? Jesus Christ. What video was it? I think it's Corona Harley Newer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, who comes up with these fucking names? <laughs> what God. happens at four o'clock in the morning when we start editing these things. I uh I can't I can't wait to look forward to Bro, Another amazing year. Hopefully, you know this year started oh, up so before great. Going to see I was excited. Yeah, this year has been yeah, one. Sean jinxed it with the 2020 talk about plagues. 
Yeah, I do remember this. Remember New Year's? We had the Roaring Twenties party, and Sean's like, "It's gonna be a play." Yeah, now we have someone to blame. I've been having all this fucking angst that I just want to get off my chest and just aim it towards someone. <laughs> if anyone else is mad, you could just blame Sean. It happens. Yeah, he's got big shoulders. Look at those big shoulders. He can handle it. Dude, oh, I get yeah. blamed for everything anyway, so I'll just roll with it. Me and me and right. Trump, we we uh, we caused Corona. That's why everybody's fucked. It was my Good dog. Stews. It was actually my dog too. Stu- I think, who pissed over here on the floor? Well, I guarantee it wasn't Stewie. Sean? 100% oh. me. I was trying to hit the I was fucked up. I thought I was in the bathroom. I was trying to hit the toilet from the couch. How lazy Shitter. I could come. I think we found the corporate. Corporate? Corp- corporate. Culprit. Corporate? I culprit. Corporate. Culprit. 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 <laughs> One of those uh, coincidence words. Someone called Corporate. It's Someone shoulder, called corporate get him the hell out of here. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. Dude, I you ever have like a dream and you don't get to finish it? Yeah. And you're like, fuck, dude, I, I had the craziest fucking dream last night. Do tell. I'm talking about dog pigs and motorcycle gangs. <laughs> what? <laughs> Was How it more dog or pig? Take? Huh? Dog pigs, bro. What did it look like? So our friend, uh, DP, had a bunch of, picture this, it has the body of a pig, but the head of a pit bull. <laughs> See, like, I feel like it looks dangerous until it comes out of like the shadows and see its body. I'm just like, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like the I... body of a pig and a head of a pit bull, and he's breeding these things. And I thought it was fucking crazy and wild. And his whole house was set up like a labyrinth, and all the bushes <laughs> and grass was overgrown. And then our other friend, Skinny C, was in a motorcycle gang. <laughs> <laughs> How high were what? you when you went to bed? Dude, <laughs> they they show up they show up with Harleys because Skinny C's got the uh, he knows about these dog pigs so he leads the gang over <laughs> to steal these pigs. Where are they putting the pigs on, pigs on their motorcycles? They so they end up stealing them. like two pigs, and I'm like hiding in the corner, and I can see it. Well, uh, Skinny C gets whacked <laughs> because he knows too much. Oh. Skinny, yeah, you're killing friends off in your dreams. Oh. Yes. <laughs> I hope you got some retaliation. You and the so then I going. I escape down. They see me, and then I escape down like a couple lev- levels into the labyrinth of DP's fucking house, and uh, I woke up. And I tried so hard to go back to sleep so I could I was finish this fucking to go back story. To the Challenge yourself to see if you can get out. You know, everyone feels exactly how I felt. You've heard the story, and now you want to hear the rest of it, but I don't have it for you. <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing for you. This sounds like up. one of those 80s movies. Dog pigs. <laughs> Pig monkey men in the woods. Like one of those low I just don't know if I'd movies. be so scared of a dog pig. Can someone like Photoshop? It's... What about Jedi <laughs> Jedi Monkey? Does he still listen? Can you Photoshop a pit bull's head on a pig's body, please? I feel like his editing skills are way better than yours. He can make that happen. Yeah, at this point, yeah. Come on, Jedi. Let's let's do this here. You're in what week two of your editing tutorials? Yeah, handling. Oh man. I'm just excited to see what you come out with. I can't wait to see fucking dog head pigs flying around. And I'm shit. literally going to turn your fucking shoot head to a, to a penis. I just can't wait oh, to shoot content. It shouldn't be hard, dickhead. Fill up that YouTube channel with Jeff content. Dog pigs. Dog pigs in the fucking labyrinth. 
chasing him down. Doc Pig Labyrinth. Oh no! Maybe, maybe we go will down finally another level. get. Maybe we will get our finally get our Butch Dixon ad that we've all wanted to see. He's in quarantine, bro. Man, he's got an island somewhere. He's fucking fuck off. I'm just saying. The What's the last craziest dream you guys could think of? That was my. Um, I feel like I do remember a crazy dream where it was like kind of like to say I was in a house and it was like a bunch of people like that, like were acquaintance from like work and stuff. And like, they all had guns and we like, we were running from someone, but then it like turned out to like where we all just started like shooting each other. And shit, and everyone was just like running for themselves. And then I remember, like, I ran in a house, and they wanted like my gun in the house or whatever. And I was like trying to keep them out. And was it like that Belco, the Belco experiment? Elaborate on Belco. But what was that? The movie Belco experiment, where it's all these people who work at this company, and they basically like lock the doors and shut everyone in. And they basically have to kill someone has oh, yeah, to die yeah, kill, like yeah. every hour. Otherwise, they'll just kill someone randomly. So it's all these coworkers just killing each other. Basically, this was that was my dream. Yeah, I, I had a safe <laughs> spot, and I was not like I just remember like I had it was a six shooter gun, but I swear to God, I shot this thing like sixty fucking times. Dude, I'm just like popping because, out windows, listen, fucking man, the door would open, I'd slam movie. it, fucking start shooting out the door, like. And think, yeah, I just remember being like my spot, and I woke up. Think about all those '80s movies with the unlimited ammo and guns. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, dude. That's what Six your dream just was. Pew 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 pew. Did it make that sound I, too? Yeah, of course. <laughs> what kind of noise does your gun make in your dreams? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's the international. I mean, if you if you hear someone say pew 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 pew, don't you duck? I'm like, I'm like a oh, pew. Shit, who's shooting? Yeah. If I hear yeah, pew, you one. don't need to duck. It's probably a stormtrooper, and he's gonna miss. <laughs> I know. <laughs> like, now that's probably what I was shooting. Fucking infinity ammo. <laughs> Tell you what, I'd fuck a stormtrooper up. I'm glad you finished it. I thought you said you're gonna fuck a stormtrooper. Hey, you don't know. There might be some hot lady <laughs> stormtrooper out there that just needs a good dick in from the quarantine. Really? I might oblige. Yeah, uh, good looking female stormtrooper that needs a dick in. What's that uh, email, Sean? Come on, man. I'm trying to get laid. Look at the email. The gentleman's then pod at gmail.com. Any stormtroopers yeah, out there looking to get <laughs> pew pewed by Francis? <laughs> I'm going to need a three day COVID test. Negatives. If you get a positive, you're already out. Just letting you know now. I guess technically, like I said, I, I'm sick. I didn't even know it. Yeah. You're the illest. I went, to, <laughs> I went to the doctor and had my ears cleaned, and he was all like, your throat looks like you have an infection. And I'm going to give you a Z-Pack. And I said, thanks, Doc. Solid. I appreciate it. Have so you ever had this dream? Now you're quarantining? Uh, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I've been quarantining. I don't understand how I even got sick. That's what I'm saying. Have you, uh. It's inevitable that I'm going to get sick. Ever had those dreams? You have to now because you're fucking. You're super susceptible. Yeah, okay, finish that. I'm fucking what? You're fucking. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear Sean's dream now. Oh, have you, you ever had those, the last one you remember? Those dreams that were like super vivid, like you could feel what's going on. Like you, I had a dream where I fucking somehow oh. owned a motorcycle and I was <laughs> driving it, and I could feel the fucking wind going over my glasses and hitting my fucking eyelashes. 
Zach? Did you wake up and your eyes were like super dry? <laughs> no, no. I woke up and I was just like, you know, I'm like, where were you riding? Was it like a like normal setting, or was street? it like some futuristic? No, no. It was just up and down my street, and it was so it was so vivid and real that I, I think that was when more I woke of a sign. Up, I thought just I had, down your street. I was we drove over to my stepdad's house. All right, three blocks. That's but, it. But it was so vivid and real when I woke up in the morning. I'm like, where the fuck is my bike? I want to go ride. <laughs> I've had See, those before I've where, been... like, I crashed my car in my dream, and I, like, looked out the window to yeah. see if my car was fucked up or not. Because you just didn't know if you were fucking wasted and didn't I, Yeah, it was so vivid. <laughs> I, I drove it, like, kind of like Sean's. It was down the street from my house, and I crashed into the fucking tree. <laughs> You guys are just and shitty it was drivers. So in real seat. that I had to check out the window. No, it wasn't even me being. I was, it was. I drove fine. It just. I could feel the fucking wind. I always. That's what I remember the most was that that weird feeling where the you wind feel, feeling. Yeah, when it just goes over your glasses and punches you in the eyes, and you're not used to it, so you're tearing up. I still right. want to know socks on or socks off there in this dream. If I'm dreaming, if I'm asleep, I don't wear socks. If you sleep with socks uh, would, on, you're a fucking psychopath. <laughs> would Liquid you, dreams. Excuse me. Would you would you drive a motorcycle with or without socks? <laughs> These are the dumbest fucking questions. You, you know, Our listeners need to know if you. Well, I don't wear. Socks, I, don't, I wear socks. I, and shoes, I ride a motorcycle bro. with shoes on, and I don't wear shoes without socks. So yeah, I'm socks always gonna have socks on. I've definitely seen you fucking wear shoes without socks. Mr. Long feet. term, if I gotta walk the dog or something, sure I'll. What do you mean? You, your ass is. You know, I spent days with you walking around with shoes, no fucking socks on. How dare you? You riding your motorcycle and you're like, here. I'm like, dude, I got sandals on. I ain't fucking riding. Yeah, no, here, bro. Just take my shoes. I'm like, dude, you don't even have socks on. I don't have socks on. Guess what? I still wore those stinky shoes of yours and went riding. No, that's about as I ridiculous did. as you tackling Devin Hester. I could do it. No. If anyone knows Devin Esther. I mean, I've seen him at the Frankie mall. Frankie has but. delusions of grandeur. <laughs> <laughs> I can totally tackle Devin Hester. It was in a fucking my lane in the Oklahoma drill. I'm Maybe in the one Oklahoma out of time. drill. If I still don't a, think I mean, so. two-foot hallway, you might be able to take him down. <laughs> I, still don't think, I still think he just gets bulldozed <laughs> over. It just depends on how bad I sacrifice my body because that's not what, what I'm doing. Mike it's, Allstott, not a chance. Can I tackle him? Yeah, I bet I could because I'm going to bite his ankles. That's the, I'm taking Dude, his fucking ankles he's just out. Just going that's to it. splatter you. <laughs> it's fine. I got a whole lot of plastic on. I just got to throw my body down. Honestly, like I, I don't said, think he's probably going to hurt on me nine out of nine out of ten. But that one time I'm tackling him. I don't think you get low enough, Frankie. Are you going to tackle him or trip him? So I mean, it, it, I'm getting them down, and there's no gaining of yards after that point. So that's a tackle. <laughs> <laughs> I don't by the letter of the law, correct? Yeah, I don't think it's going to be a, a fucking. I clamp don't and think drive you can to the get ground. low enough. I've seen the your same, flexibility. <laughs> I don't think you can get low enough. That, that shoulder. I think Mike Allsott just lowers his helmet and sends you flying. Like, yeah, it'd be like probably like a kid who put his arm out, and I would just. <laughs> you would look like one of those <laughs> Grand Theft Auto pedestrians getting hit on GTA. <laughs> just go fly. flying. <laughs> oh, I don't know, man. I might just, I just might pull the fucking momentum card on him and just take him by the face mask, fucking throw him forward. That's not like a tackle. They do out of the... Get out of that car, bitch. <laughs> That's not a tackle. <laughs> Ole. What do you mean? He's down on the ground. Throw yeah, the flag. Well, I don't give a fuck. Your, you can't tackle him by the face mask. You illegal. It's right? considered he's down. That's a 15-yard penalty. <laughs> they find, I mean, they just find, uh, find, what was it, A.J. Brown from Titans. He threw the ball in the stands. Seven find grand. him like seven or – Yeah. <laughs> seven grand because he threw a COVID ball into the stands. He got a bunch of people <laughs> sick. <laughs> Who did? <laughs> That's fucking – Jalen Ramsey? Brown. No, A.J. Brown. He threw a cold football. Wasn't that after the kickoff? Touchdown. 
Was that on the kickoff return uh, one? Where they tried I, know, the I didn't watch that game. It? I didn't have a bet on him. When they I hit had, again, though. Did you see that? When they onside kicked it, he just picked up the onside and ran it in? No, <laughs> no, I didn't. <clears throat> yeah, A.J. Brown. Joke's on you. Shouldn't be getting fined for shit I should be able to do. Right. You can't throw COVID balls into the stands, bro. There's no one in the stands. There's. Oh, there is, I think. I think Tennessee, they do. There is. I guess in some places. Other countries have got vaccines. We're going to be doing one here soon, and hopefully, fucking shit just go back to normal. I mean, you're not going to miss you guys. What's normal? Uh, I don't understand. I mean, it's not going to be available. Like, where, like, I could just. So when it's, like, flu level, then you're cool with it? I mean. Once there's a yeah. vaccine and people still get sick and die, but at least I can go outside. Yeah, right. I, I To be honest <laughs> with you, I just don't want to go out and wear a mask anymore. It's just. I should put my mask on right now so then people know what I look like out in public. If you were to say like, that oh, to my lady, if you were to say that to my lady, she'd punch you right in the fucking face. She has well, to she wear has one for wear 17 hours a day. day. Her face is breaking out in acne. She's over it. I do. I bet. You I wear, wear it to the store for five minutes and you're bitching. <laughs> How dare you? Why do you think I got a fucking red throat? The doctor said, you know, shit. <sighs> I'm wearing the mask. Yeah, I'm just saying I'm ready for it to be over. I think I, a lot of other people are too. Well, once Biden gets in, it's going to be over. So this is yeah. Right. Well, once he legalizes weed federally, <laughs> we're going to make a lot of money. I'm going to tell you right now. Uh, so that's one thing. No one cure at all. Once the government gets all that weed money, everything's going to be cured. They already had a. They already had a. The bill passed through the House. It's now on to the Senate, which is full of a bunch of 95-year-old fucking dinosaurs that still believe that Reefer Madness is a true fucking movie. <laughs> Blowing jazz horns in people's asses and jumping out windows. Jazz horns! So, it's about fucking time, man. Let's get spiritual. The Let's one legalize thing it all. excited about it for is the fact of like the other uses, like how like it would there's like you can make paper and like fuel sources and shit like that. Yeah, like, we watch we, we watch Biodome too. We know the the significance of the sticky purple punch or purple <laughs> sticky punch. See, you're gonna make someone super happy. What's your name? <laughs> super sticky purple punch. Purple sticky punch. Oh shit! What I was it? Oregon it now, right? Me. Oregon, yeah. you can get whatever the fuck you want. Yeah. No, you. What does that mean? You. Cannot get arrested for having possession of drugs. I seen a great meme the other day where it was like going to a restaurant in Oregon. She's like, Can I get some Coke? He's like, We have Pepsi. She's like, Okay, I'll get a gram of Coke and some Pepsi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, shit. That, that's not how it works. It's not like you can go to a dispensary for. Oh, I can't do bath. blow at the restaurant. I feel like that'll probably be a thing in thirty thirty. The world ain't gonna be the world in another thousand years or ten thousand years, there, bud. Thousand years. I'm, yeah, bro. I'm Elon just saying, is sending though. us to fucking Mars. Yeah, are we do that for fun now. People are going to space and just like fuck COVID. I'm not There's no planet. COVID in Mars. <laughs> Dude, they can't you're survive the atmosphere. Air, that thing. <laughs> you're talking about airplanes being death traps. <laughs> Oh fuck! You don't think that fucking think space about that, be a though. death trap? The spaceship? Which one? People, people in the spaceships right now are like all these motherfuckers are bitching about being in quarantine. I've been in a sardine can for years, right? <laughs> That's gotta be. I think By I choice, can do that. I'm, I'm fine. By Most choice, choice. they chose. When's the At least last they're time probably you like, fuck all you. Co- <laughs> huh? When's the last time you watched Armageddon? Um, it was actually on not too long ago. I seen probably like, I probably like two it. weeks ago, three weeks, four months, weeks ago. It's so bad. What do you mean? It's so good. No, it's not. 
I mean, it's got a love story. They saved the world. <laughs> What's better than saving the world? You're they're fucking heroes, I man. I love you, Harry. Honestly, I don't remember. I love you, Harry yeah. Stamper. I mean, for real though, when I was watching it and he had those things around his neck, I thought he was gonna fucking snap that shit. So the only That's one. That's just a good old fashioned Jerry Brockheimer, or was it Michael Bay? Right, Michael Bay. Oh, it has a whole lot of camera angles going over. A lot of swooping camera I angles. See. Everything goes from Didn't day to you? night real quick. It was Jerry Brockheimer, <laughs> I believe. Everything blows up. Someone checks the mail. Their mailbox blows up. Everything just blows up. Blows. Every time you said blows, it echoes. Blows. Stop blowing up things. Oh, Is what? it Jerry Brockheimer or Michael Bay? I feel like it's Michael Bay. I think it's Jerry Brockheimer. Let me, I'm looking it up right now. Look at you two. This is Learning Channel. You got to put out the right information. You can't be fucking going on a gentleman's guess. It's shot like Michael Bay. I just feel like it's... I agree with you on Oh, no, it was Michael Bay. Goddamn right it was. It was Michael <laughs> Bay. I, I was, yeah. I, I, this is how it's shot. It, for sure. The slow motion, yeah. walking scenes. There's so many space ones where it's like going over in the world and... American flags, which I don't have a problem with, but it's just American flags all up in your face for He's two just hours. all about it, man. America, motherfucker. America. I think someone you. in one of the Transformers movies, they counted the American flags, and it was like 213 times you saw an American flag. You know what that is to me? That's just well edited, all right? <laughs> How am I going to make this movie longer? Michael Bay loves two things. <laughs> Michael Bay loves two things. America and blowing shit up. That's what he. <laughs> There's nothing more American than blowing shit up, right? Oh fuck! It's Fourth of July every day for Michael Bay. That doesn't sound like it's so bad. Oh, I. So. Those movies don't age well, do they? I feel like they're just I don't great think classics. Any of Michael like... Bay's movies age well. See, I accept movies for what they are. Yeah, I am piles of shit maybe maybe of the time. <laughs> my personal preference. I might not have liked it, but then I step in the shoes of someone that actually likes movies like that and think about how they would feel about it and what aspects and what the story and the meaning of the movie is, and it takes some shit out of them. You know, man, real life lessons is what movies about. No, all action movies. I feel like. 80s, 90s, and even like the early 2000s. You mean comedies? All, Action comedies? They've all turned into comedies. <laughs> oh, yeah. They weren't intended to be comedies. For sure. But now when you watch them, you just laugh your fucking ass off. If you even like hit the menu on it or something, it'll say comedy on some of those. Action comedy. Like. Well, Bad Boys okay. wasn't action comedy because it had Martin Lawrence in it. I don't yeah, know, that was about some badass action. motherfuckers shooting shit up. But on Bloodsport, it's not going to say action comedy. Action. What do you mean? When he dips his knuckles in the peanut butter? Comedy. What was that called? Peanut butter, nut knuckles. <laughs> nut knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Don't be fucking with nut knuckles over there. Ah. Uh. Yeah, that'd be a fucking cool nut nickname. Just uh, where's nut knuckles? <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! Fucking having your food period. ordered. I got a uh, burger and fries for uh, nut knuckles. <laughs> oh, just fucking every time we go somewhere, and he puts down her name. What is it? Voltron. <laughs> Voltron party of because it's super badass. Voltron, it's badass as shit, man. It's super <laughs> badass. Can I put down a name for you, honey? Voltron. The fuck? Parents must have been some weird Five ass lion guy. bots turned into one big lion bot. Um. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I can't Power wait Rangers. for fucking spring. Bro, Why? Man. You're not going outside. <laughs> what are you talking about? 
I went outside this I year. like when I look outside the window and it's sunny out. It right now pretty. it's dark. Hey, I does the, do not like it dark. Hey, how, how do we know the winter's not going to kill the coronavirus? Right. Yeah. We don't know. You might be onto something there. I thought that pastor was sending the wind of God. When's that coming? Oh, dude, that dude, I'm <laughs> telling you, I cannot wait for his skin to rip off and his lizard form to be shown. Did you see did someone happen? did like a metal version of one of his oh, yeah. uh, preaches and they had the guitar? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> COVID! Oh, I just, I'm looking forward wait. to Elkhart Lake. And riding motorcycles, Sean's Sean's dream, I think, was a vivid, vivid sign to buy a motorcycle. I think it was a vision, right? Like a you calling a motorcycle. Buy Cosmos a was telling him to get a motorcycle. Biogram, shit, right now. Biogram, <laughs> biogram, biogram. Not a sponsor. Didn't you, how did you feel when you woke up from that dream, Sean? I felt disappointed that I didn't own that motorcycle. Right. See? Or I actually, See? I thought someone stole it. Like, I had a conversation right. with Zach. Like, I was like, hey, man, didn't I have a motorcycle? He's like, you got a moped. <laughs> like, like, yeah, I know yeah. I got that. But didn't I have a fucking motorcycle yesterday? See, Where is it? You need to get one. Telling you, man. Eventually. It's like a, it's like a wave runner. Like you, you just smile when you're on it, dude. It's the best quarantine machine you can have. Right, you're locked you inside a helmet, yeah. six feet apart. <laughs> you <laughs> ride, ride, crazy. ride, ride. But I'm excited for Elkhart Lake next year. You thought yeah. I got drunk last year? I'm gonna get God. fucked up. Plus, your tolerance is so low. Year. Yeah, I had like three shots and two beers last week. I was sitting here, I was like, "Holy fuck!" Like this is this. I'm drunk. I'm happy for you. You needed that. I did. I, now I'm sick. Because <laughs> your oh, immune no, system, no, your sick. immune system is fucked. I know, right? I'm just gonna get sick the next time I go out. Well, no, just. Drink. Every time you go outside, you're just being attacked, and your body has go, no idea what's happening. I go to the hospital like once, at least once a week. Just, so, and drink forty gallons oh, of, of uh, dad, orange but... juice again. Oh God! What do you mean? That was that's an enha- that's an enhancer. <laughs> no, I when I was super sick, you remember that? I was super fucking sick and. I drank like three he got of those citric gallons. acid burns down his throat from drinking too much orange juice. I drank three gallons of fucking Tropicana and Simply Orange and all that shit. But why? Because I was trying C, to get bro. on vitamin C. That's all I drink is orange juice, tea, and then I have soup when I'm sick. That's it. Frankie has the most. Better. Do you drink the soup or do you use no, a spoon? Both. Mrs. Grass. With the little egg ball, they don't do the egg ball anymore. It's probably made out of some kind of plastic cancer that we were putting in our food for all Frankie the years. Has then the you most, heat it up. The weirdest bro. You don't know how to make fucking soup, bro. The weirdest bro science when it comes to fucking bro can't microwave nothing because it kills all the fucking nutrients in this food. <laughs> I'm gonna drink all the vitamin C. I don't. I, I will eat bags of oranges. <laughs> I don't give. I did. I was too. Oranges. I'll have. Dude, it's crazy how someone can affect you. Like you went to personal trainer college, and one dude told you some fairy godmother tale about microwaves, and you never not, touch one. Not since. some dude. The instructor when we were talking about nutrition. Well, he's an idiot. Said it takes the <laughs> nutrition value out. You should I, call your instructor teacher. and slap him in the fucking face. You know how many, and say, do you know how book. microwaves work? Look at how many meal prep right. companies there is. Yeah, I mean. It's all microwavable meals. I'm just yeah, saying, when bro, I make soup, the I'm not microwaving it. I fucking put some water on the stove <laughs> and heat it, and then you put the noodles in, and then you're good. I'm already done That's eating it. by the it, time you're... 
water, your your water's boiling. I'm done already. That's gross. You're gross. That is fine. Microwave user. <laughs> no, I know what's wrong with you. It's You've been out of a microwave your whole life. I mean, at what's McDonald's, they just microwave your, your food, right? I'm like the Toxic Avenger. That's a pretty cool Avenger. Yeah. I, I, I microwave, say. man. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. What are you fucking hitting people with your water warming rays? Yeah, vibrates oh. the water. That's what heats the food. I'll vibrate that water, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what kind of situation that they're going to get themselves right? into. Where's Toxic Man? You toxic Avenger, you fucking... son of a bitch. If some Not WAP really... showed up. Put some some wet ass pussy. Put some respect Just vibrate on his that name. water. What do you mean? It's like macaroni in a pot. Well, I'm saying, like, if it's WAP, it's all it's wet ass pussy. So you just you vibrate the water. Is that the noise no. it makes? <laughs> wap, 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 wap. <laughs> you guys are with me. All right, I can tell. I'm, I, I'm not there. I'm not there. Microwave man. Yeah, I got it. You got microwave for hands. What else? It's nuking. It's nuking, motherfuckers. Nuking shit. <laughs> Take her down to Nuketown. Oh, is that past Pound Town? Nuketown. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's a block past Pound Town. <laughs> we're going past. No, no, we're not going to Pound Town. Past Pound Town. We're no, going Nuketown. Past Pound Town. I'm going to fucking vibrate that water, bitch. Did you know that's what they call dollar stores and. Uh, across the pond? No, tell me. Just, you answered it. Pound Town. <laughs> uh, I see what you did there. Guys, the fucking <sighs> it's a pound. Oh. No, it's legit. Like, they have dollar stores because they, they don't use dollars. They have pounds. So their dollar stores are called Pound Town. I'm going, it's man. fucking hilarious. I'm all in. Can we go for just a picture and then... Frankie, once again, you would actually have to leave your house to go somewhere. Right. I leave all and the time. And get on an airplane. Fucking bubble boy. <laughs> I'm just going to say, for like 46 weeks, I was at Jeff's house every Saturday. And now this is nice. I get to see you from here. It's great. I do feel bad that I won't ever see that house again, but. Eight months ago, you saw it. That was my tear. Beautiful. Yeah, just make sure you pack up all my stuff. It's there. I did. I I got your charger. He already sold did it. Did you really find that charger? Yeah. You are a fucking look at you. You're a gentleman. I put it in a special bag just for you. This is what a right there. That's what a gentleman looks in the like. microwave. the <laughs> microwave. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. How high are you guys? What the fuck are we talking about? Microwave? Hi, how are you? <laughs> Sean is like fucking zoned off over there. No, my oh, dog's going to turn some shit. Stewie. Yeah, go ahead and give a follow to Stewie the Mutt on Instagram. <laughs> I wonder if that's his real Instagram. I know that dog's got a fucking Instagram. Sean Chewy said. the butt. I think it Chewy doesn't have butt. an Instagram. Who has more followers, Sean or his dog? <laughs> <laughs> I need this. I need this handle. We have to called. check this. <laughs> so does Stewie just take selfies all day, or what? Is, How is pissed the, is does the... Sean get when he checks? And Stewie's know. just climbing the ranks. Mother fuck. I don't know what he gets more of. I mean, I was watching. There was wrestling on this week, and it looked like there was some crazy stuff in the commercials and the previews. I'm pretty sure Sean was pissed. I don't like know what would be more upsetting. I don't know, man. The one guy said the one thing to the other guy, and then they wrestled. <laughs> so they were like... <laughs> they, they were like... They were intensely in conversation with each other. It was, it was intense. I thought you... What do you mean? I thought you were talking about like a commercial during wrestling. 
No, it was an actual. You're talking commercial. about like the soap opera, like before they <laughs> and after they wrestle. Yeah, like it was a commercial saying like what craziness was going to happen on wrestling this week. And it, they're, oh my god, these guys. Now it just, dude, it was super hype, and I was just like, man, Sean's going to really love that. I thought it was interesting. I don't know. We'll have to ask him what happened. Yeah. On Monday See, night whenever Raw. we talk about wrestling, Sean's never here. But now All we right. can't keep talking about it. We have to move on to the next subject. No. Well, we're you and I are more of the wrestling fan, fans than Sean. Right. So he probably That's why wouldn't we even know about... what we're talking about. Right. Well, I won't. Right? You take care. Of, you take care of stuff and things, Sean. Big bear, you. What? How many followers does your dog have? I don't even know. I haven't looked in a while. <laughs> What's his Instagram? You haven't looked in a while. Or he's got more than you, so you don't check anymore. <laughs> oh, I'm sure he's got more than me. I'm pretty sure the podcast has more than me. <laughs> <laughs> what is his Instagram, Stewie? That's why he's yelling and barking. He wants a shout out on the fucking Stewie the Chug, right? Yep. Stewie the Chug, Stewie go the follow. Chug. Let's get him more followers than all of us combined. Well, we are only have like beat five. Jeff with your fucking three followers. You got? How bro. dare you? <laughs> <laughs> I almost got twice as many with five. I don't have time, man. And plus, I want to live a healthy life. I watched the fucking social dilemma. I'm okay, unplugging. Thing. Oh, you can go you're off the grid. You would have to actually plug in to unplug. Yeah. Oh. How dare you offend all those people? No, I go, I, dude. I only have time for like one. I don't understand these people who have like Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok. So uh, there's a thing, and it's an app. Tweeter, and you connect them all. On one app, and then you just post it once. And Boom, it goes global. And it goes to all of them, global, bro. Fucking. It goes right on the line. On the line with all of it, with like this one and that one. I'm glad you guys wanted to start this online business, not knowing any online. <laughs> online what do you mean? We have what a are you business. About? I, people keep telling me that I'm not doing anything and I'm unemployed. I have a business. You were unemployed for a hot minute. No, I'm still not doing anything. What do you mean? I take care of my father. I take him to the hospital twice a week. See doctors. That's how I got the COVID. Damn hospitals, bro. I heard they're hot spots. Probably. If you don't have to, don't go to a hospital. That's why I can't wait to die from some crazy disease. PSA, bro. We're out here fucking giving the public safety and service to not go to hospitals unless you need to go to a hospital. See, people need to know stuff like that. Just saying. Dropping knowledge bombs from Frankie. Knowledge. I wish I had just like knowledge bombs that were like, can you edit that? That Knowledge bombs? I can edit in. I'll edit in some bombs. Pew, pew. Pew, pew, pew. No, No, no one's shooting. Like, what's some bombs? Oh. Just... <laughs> there we go. Knowledge bomb. See? Sean gets my knowledge bombs. Call it. Knowledge bomb all over. <laughs> what do you mean? Frankie. How many knowledge bombs out here? A knowledge bomb all over. Khabib would beat Shaq in a fight. Oh, don't get him started. I agree with you, but I, I still think Shaq LeBron James. Knock Could LeBron out. James take Khabib? Never going to get off? No. I mean, I don't think LeBron could take Jordan, so I don't think he could take a fighter. Jordan, fuck anyone up. There's nothing that Jordan can do. Just whips out his golden penis and Just pisses his excellence. That's it. That's what Jordan does, bro. Uh, Some of people that are born. I would love to see it, though. His golden penis? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) I want you to clarify what you want to see. (laughs) I mean, I'm I'm confused. I'd feel like Charlie. I'd feel like Charlie. Just 
unwrap that golden that that chocolate bar and <laughs> that big old golden ticket's just staring me right in the face. I feel like you'd be so excited like that child. The the look of excitement on your face would be priceless. I would just run home to my ten grandparents laying in bed in the middle of the room. Did they ever That's explain not weird. that? <laughs> that might have been the and that mean? movie that was so fucked up, but those eight grandparents in the middle of the bed in the middle of the room might be the most fucked up part of that movie. I think that that's normal? I don't know. You? I remember yeah, I remember your Gma. He's hanging out, you turn the TV off, she yell at you. I'm watching that it's, it's no different. Every time. Every time. I'm just resting my eyes. I'm watching that. <laughs> <laughs> Every Holla time. Holla douchebag. Holla douchebag. <laughs> Rest in peace, Grandma. <laughs> yeah, Gima. Gima. No, we're talking, that would be the, we were talking about uh, Willy Wonka. I think the most fucked up part of that movie was all the grandparents laying in one bed in the middle of the room. Yeah. Change my mind. I don't think I don't understand why he needs that explained. I think that's completely normal, don't you? Or no? No. You in or out of the boat? That's dude. <laughs> well, how come Charlie gets the golden ticket and he, the, the grandpa just gets up and starts break dancing? I thought that motherfucker was crippled and he's he right. Work he's in bed. Here's, yeah, get out there. Here's the other him. question: If they're bedridden, that means they're pissing and shitting in bedpans. You got four people in the same bed pissing and shitting in probably the same pan. Damn. That house has got to smell like a sack full of assholes. That's why they got all the holes in the roof. Yeah, that's why they cut the roof open. Yeah, I mean, I feel like it was explained pretty well. You guys just don't read between the lines in movies. Well so enough. when Charlie got the factory at the end, wait a minute, spoiler alert. When Charlie <laughs> gets the factory at the end. <laughs> Sorry, I just ruined it. <laughs> I apologize for that. Charlie gets the factory at the end. So do they move the the whole bed? I just want you to remember. Oh, they don't need time. to move. They, they just get new beds. But they got like the Oompa Loompas massaging their legs so they don't yeah. get blood. Yeah, blood. bro. They, they, yeah, they're going to put a bed in the middle of Chocolate River on the island. They eat gumdrops off the trees. Dude, Charlie's uncle is getting his wife back to her feet so he can give her the old fucking high hard one. <laughs> you know what that means? That that floating... That, that bed's f- going to be shaking. That floating, high and hard? The floating candy or the floating juice makes you go what up, about, too. What about yeah. if I gave her the... Uh, the never-ending cop stopper? Yeah, so I was just about to say that. <laughs> That's what his nutsack is. Is that Never- what it is? Ending nutsack. I feel Go like for it. Andy would sell. You businesses, so? man, just making these businesses up. Never ending nutsack. Gumdrop. <laughs> Never ending nutsack. Get stuck on it for hours. I can see the infomercial now. Right. You could have, you could show people the fucking sham down. the sham wow guy. <laughs> yeah, look at what I got here. Nutsack, sucking it for hours. Why did he go to like a never loses flavor? Joe Pesci all of a sudden is doing infomercials. No, you're t- he's talking like the guy that got his tongue bit by the hooker and punched yeah, her in the, the face. Slap chop. <laughs> you're gonna love Which my nuts. Is, remember that? Fun. You're gonna love my nuts. Yeah, I just remember the slapping. You slap it, you chop it. You get suck on these nuts for hours. Never loses flavor. Look at this. Billy Mays. You mean my ideas already thought of? There's already a... Billy Mays doing never ending. hilarious, too. Billy fucking Mays. Who's the new guy? The Flexio guy? He's like the new hotness now. Well, yeah, he Slap looks it like, on! Anytime! He looks like... Uh, a knockoff Billy Mays. Like, he needs to grow a beard. Yeah, I don't believe him. Yeah. Grizzly Adams that, did have glass, a beard. It's a beard. I might buy it. The glass boat. Yeah, we got rid of our boat. We should just make PGD one out of flex seal next year. Experiment. 
just put flak seal on a bunch of shit. We'll, we'll, yeah, just, I mean, we'll get some fucking piping. Fire. And we'll get some PVC piping. We'll make a big ass boat. We'll, we'll fucking get screened, wrap it around the PVC <laughs> pipe. We'll fucking flex seal that motherfucker. And we'll just go party it. We'll get a bunch of those big sticks. <clears throat> For we'll sure. Just, we're sure ways, you know, like let's just make like the biggest longboard ever that like thirty people could party on. Just a flex seal board. Yeah, I feel like this is a thing. Now I have something to do this winter. I was gonna do a puzzle, but flex seal board sounds way more fun. You know what I've just... learned to enjoy more and more. <laughs> What's that? Puzzles. Those uh, prescription drug commercials. I used to not be able to stand them, and now I just laugh every time. Did you hear the one where if you take it, your taint gets a rash? Dude, I just love when they're explaining all that shit about your taint getting a rash and explosive diarrhea, and the people in the commercials are just smiling and having the time of their life. They're living their best life now. (laughs) I'm sitting down, I'm watching, I'm on Netflix or whatever, Hulu, and the commercials come on. The commercials are way more hardcore on Hulu than they are on regular TV. They like dial them back a little bit on TV. But Hulu oh, really? just goes so for like it. The, the Hulu Skittles ones, commercial, the Hulu drug commercials, go for it. There's like one of the side effects could be your itchy perineum, which is <laughs> your taint. Like, why yeah, does it? I'm atta- just saying, do you guys never had an itchy taint? But what I'm asking is, why does it attack your taint? Not to where I needed to see a doctor. Like what? What's in the drug? <laughs> what's in the drug that makes you taint all itchy? I don't know, but it's saving your life. Apparently, forty things of uh, side effects. It's doing one thing good, I think. Right. Once they I start like listening to side they... effects, I'm like, how much time is left in this commercial? Twenty five <laughs> seconds. Like here we go. All side effects. They're playing volleyball. Yeah. <laughs> I just the butthole might explode say, in about 35 minutes after taking this pill. Yeah, the uh, see your doctor right away. The bathtubs outside, taking the bubble baths outside. Like, who the fuck is right. filling up them tubs? Your jizz it's the may same turn people green. that have a campfire on the beach. <laughs> right, your, your jizz matter. may turn green. <laughs> <laughs> I like the ones that say you can die when that, with. with you know, from taking it, and then it says if you stop taking it, it could cause it could increase your risk of death. It's like, hold on, or hold don't on. take it. Don't take it if you're allergic to it. <laughs> That's the what I was just gonna say. Yeah. What? But like the side effects. It's by stopping, it may cause death. So you mean I I can't even stop taking it now? I might die from taking it, but if I stop, I might die too. Did you know that if you get out of bed tomorrow, you might die? Might. I'd slip in the I'm shower. I'm just saying, it, that should be a side effect for everyone to know. When they get up, just... Side effect of life. Worst. Side effect death. of life you may, may cause death. The only thing guaranteed, right? In life is that death. That is. The taxes. only thing. Death and taxes. I think you're only guaranteed today. Death and taxes. I don't know. There's guys that evade that shit. I've seen it. Wesley Snipes and... That's why you gotta get on it, bro. You had to make a bunch of shitty movies to pay that shit back. (laughs) Expendables. There's a bunch of shitty movies. He had to join the Expendables cast. You know that he was bottom bitch. He got bottom dollar. Oh, you're a loving guy? The new dude who's playing Blade has some big shoes to fill. Oh, man. I don't even want to see him ruin it. It's gonna 2021 though. Fucking, there's like 30 movies coming out. I can't wait to see. They've I can't all been, remember one of them. But top gun two. Court. 2020 was in like the third stage of the nine stage blowjob. Yeah, and it was just. It just got cork. Just corking all these good movies. And 2021 is gonna blow its load all over the fucking oh, theater. Shotgun blast! I'm so ready for oh. it. Do you look like Stan's dad when they had the that Stan's dad meme where he's sitting at the computer? And there's just jizz all over the room. Everywhere. The movie release is gonna be. 
That's what I'm saying. Top Gun, Back Fast up. Nine. Saved up for you guys. Let me know what movie we're releasing. Isn't the new Avatar right. supposed to come out in 2021? Maybe. Dude, we've, we've done this. We've gone through the Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters um, is supposed to come out. Yeah, there, there, there's so many. There's like a new Halloween, a new fucking like Freddy and Jason, and there's new like. Are they in space again? Uh, I'm pretty sure <laughs> they're in the ocean. Underwater. I forgot how horrible the fucking those movies got until I think I was on HBO and I was scrolling Are through those horror and I watched those yeah horror I watched a horror movies? movie and then it showed like oh you people who watch this might also like this and it was like Jason goes to hell. Jason X when he was in space. Yeah. <laughs> was you like, mean that was a great one, man. They fucking <laughs> they hooked him up to the machine. <laughs> oh, the advancements God. of and that technology when that movie was made was insane. It was so good. Right. Special effects and they fed him I mean, microwave food. That's what happened to him. Right. They preserved <laughs> the preservatives in there. It preserved his body for six hundred and thirty four years. Yeah. They just turned into the Jason. Dude, I'm telling you, every Friday, I, yeah, every Friday, I'll, I'll be, I'm more and more of a believer in all these aliens out there and stuff and all the crazy stuff that's happened in our world. Every Friday? It's definitely aliens. Fridays? When yeah, on Fridays on the History Channel, they got ancient aliens. Ooh. That dude with the crazy hair, and he just talks <laughs> about all these phenomenons and I watch There's crazy Cosmos shit that happens in the world, episodes, man. I had to turn it off. My brain, I had to unplug it. <laughs> oh, fuck. I'm in the middle of rewatching <laughs> The League. Oh, so, so good. Chill. I'm just, I mean, I'm, I'm I'm happy that I'm winning in sports betting, but I miss fantasy. I miss fantasy football, weekly matchups, talking shit after you beat someone. Like, when I just win money at the casino, it's like, I can't really talk shit to anyone. I can't be like, yeah. Oh, you're the one who backed you out. Ticket. Pay me, motherfucker. You backed out of the league, and I it. clinched a playoff spot before everybody. See, that's what you needed. I just need, we just needed to take the handcuffs off, and you just needed to go with your gut. We, we had two. We had a half of two really good teams. But when we put those two halves together, it, it, it didn't make peanut butter and jelly. It, the it made difference like is, is this year peanut all butter my and injuries. bananas. Still good. But. For some reason, all my injuries, all my pickups because of the injuries have all produced. Mike Davis. Yeah, that's huge. Mike Davis. Christian McCaffrey goes out. I pick up Mike Davis, and Mike Davis puts up fucking monster. <laughs> goes off. Of yeah, Ronald no, Jones. it's good when you when you pick up those things and it works. And you know what I mean? Sometimes it's just it's your time, baby. This is your time. No. Championship. Russell Wilson's playing like dog shit. I don't know if I'm going to get fucking McCaffrey back. Cool. No George Kittle. God damn it. Fingers crossed. I haven't seen any of their cool pick me fantasy football videos. Do you remember those? They were so fucking awesome. Or he's like jumping through the car windows. I'm sure they still got him. You just haven't oh, yeah. dug deep enough. You need to bring them back. Well, all these new young cats need to be doing shit. Like you know how awesome it would have been if Tyree or Ty- Tyree Cohen was uh, doing a backflip catching two balls at the same time, and he was like, "That's why you picked me in fantasy." He did do that. Oh, okay. Did I it. just didn't see the video then. My bad, Reek. I see he's out there with the swift recovery. He's on Twitch all the time. That dude's a gamer. Could you tackle him? <laughs> oh yeah. Why he just runs out For of sure. bounds? Yeah, you just gotta <laughs> get him to the sideline. He'll yeah. Go, he'll. Let him, I'm just saying, bro. He's not the biggest. He's he's electric, but no. Uh, just like the by song. The way, you know the Bears are gonna finish eight and eight this year, right? Yeah, football hell, motherfucker. We've been in it forever. You think we left? You We're never getting out of this place. Think. They're gonna win. It's the next electric. Boogie, boogie, boogie. boogie. I, I I bleed the colors. I'm a diehard fan. I love them through and through, and I always will support. But. It is very just painful and hard to watch. I've really been enjoying other NFL games and betting on them and winning lots of money. I don't know. You guys should try it. It's a lot of fun. I don't support your guys. Everyone should try it. It's easy. You just bet and you win. 
<laughs> That's what I do. I'm not wrong. <laughs> I just bet and then I win. You start a YouTube yeah, channel. I'm bet a, and win. There you go. That's what we. That's what I should do, huh? I just need to like know how to do a channel. It's difficult, ask Jeff. It's super hard. Yeah. That's I don't know how to do any of it. Would you teach me the letters? I'll show you the letters. I want to know how to read. Or you just go on YouTube and watch a, one video and you can learn how to do it. Yeah, tutorial. That's what I how do. To, and then, like, Power of YouTube. Everything. I'm just going to make, like, weird how-to videos that, like, someone would never look up. You know what I mean? How to hang a picture. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Step one, Eventually. get nail. Step two, get a hammer. <laughs> Hit nail with hammer. Learning Hang channel picture. right here, bro. All done. Frankie, you can start a YouTube channel on uh, how to look like the guy that works on his truck in the front yard of his house. <laughs> <laughs> I just sit out there and rev the engine real loud and drink a beer. Turn the music up. It's the truck's never done. Ever. You're always working on it for something. When you, once you fix something, something else breaks. That's how it goes. Right. Have you guys not fixed anything? Frank, you, you look like the guy yeah, talks of past championships in sports from high school where you were the third string backup wide receiver. Dude, I could throw a ball over them mountains. If Coach would have put me in. Devin Hester. Yeah, bro, my safety skills, it was like me and like Mike Brown. Like we're right there. Uh, here's, a, here's a question. Would you rather get run over by Mike Allstott or Mike Brown? Oh, Mike Brown. I'm, Mike Brown. You would yeah. rather get run over by Mike Brown than Mike Allstott? Mike Allstott? For sure. Put his helmet right in my chest, and I'm not going to yeah. breathe for a <laughs> solid hour. Mike Brown used to just murder guys. I know. I loved it. And he's only like 5'10". I mean, I don't want to. I'll fucking lay the wood. But, I'm, yeah, I'm for sure going to take a hit from him instead of Allstott. Allstott was like fucking. Lawrence three Taylor nine, or Derek so Thomas. He's pulling trucks in college. Lawrence Taylor yeah, or Derek Thomas? Ooh. How much coke is Lawrence Taylor on? Yeah. yeah. All of it. Because if, if he's on a ton of blow, for sure I don't want to get hit by him. It's going to be like a He's on Mike Tyson train. at his prime amount of blow. You should probably <laughs> ask Joe Theismann who he'd rather get hit by. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Not Lawrence Taylor. I don't want him coming at me. Barking. Yeah, you was probably still your wallet for Praise crack, God. too. Well, you never try crack? Make you want to steal someone's wallet. I'm telling you. I don't condemn it. No. You don't condemn? Only if you live in Oregon. You don't condemn? Crack is stealing? whack. You mean you don't condone? Uh, condone. <laughs> Conde- yeah. oh, I don't man. condemn it. I'm all right with it. My headphones are going to die because I've been... Uh, one? I got one. Did he die? I got one. I got one. <laughs> Was it hit by uh, Mike Brown? Mike Brown just took out a eye. He killed it. Five. Killed it. I've been talking to you fuckers for like three hours. I so, know. Since we don't have a theme song anymore, and any of our listeners want to get some of their music out there. Oh, yeah. Hey, um, man, it's hit me up with that CD, dog. I'm waiting for it. 30 seconds is all we need. Just like my lady. 30 seconds. Quick and easy. (laughs) Won't even break a sweat. Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. In and out. Let me get some. Damn, son, where did you find this? Look, look. Oh, Or we can just play the Raz horn for... 30 seconds. Jazz Damn, song. son, where'd you find this? Oh, shit. <laughs> All about it. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm there. I'm there with you, Raph, and my fucking frustration. I just want to I just want to go to the rooftop and just start fucking throwing roundhouses. You think we could just play fucking ninja rap? Definitely not. Don't ninja. Uh, what if we just sang it? Yeah, what if I was just like, oh, have oh, you oh, ever oh, seen oh. a turtle get down? 
I'm just saying, dude, I've seen the turtle behind you get off the rock and jump down. He's training. Training. That's, that's, I got that's him a doing 100 push-ups a day. He's sleeping pizza, now. Pizza. Wake his ass what up. Do you, what, do you mind you waving pizza busy. for food? Or? I would, but it kills the nutrients. So if, if a food is bad for you and you microwave it, does it come out better because you killed the bad stuff? Uh, I don't, do you not understand how science works? You like duke the grease and it's healthier because there's no more nutrients in the grease that's bad. Yeah, sure. I'm Love just that. saying <laughs> if it no. kills the good nutrients, why wouldn't it kill the bad nutrients? I told you, man. You just don't know anything about science. Yeah, I think at we all. just I solved it, guys. I can't. I can't explain it to you. All right. All those people that are fat just aren't using microwaves enough. And by the way, if you want to explain to Frankie why science, <laughs> why microwaves do not <laughs> kill your food, either send us I'll an email at the gentleman's den pod at gmail dot com or. Hit us up on Twitter or Instagram at TGD Podcast One, or on Facebook at The Gentleman's Den Podcast. Those are all things. Was there a? Is there a long pause when you're typing? I had a stroke. <laughs> Leave me alone. How many pauses? <laughs> How many times do I have to hit the space bar? Where's That's the pause least... button? When I type, I can never. That was at least four space bar hits. Right. Maybe maybe five. Maybe five. Just do it four and a half. Be safe. Just go and like our page so I can show it to my mom and tell her that I'm doing something positive with my life. <laughs> I think that's what everyone wants that to show their parents. That would be the parents. Gentleman's Den on YouTube. I, I just saw my mom at Thanksgiving. She's like, I saw your video. You got like two views, pussy. <laughs> felt like a loser i can't show my face at christmas come on guys give me like <laughs> give me like 10 likes man my mom's making fun of me she's like no one's watching <laughs> oh that's that's just great that's just great that's why i love your mom i can't show my keeps face it real. At christmas. She keeps it real is she even gonna let you come to the house for christmas does you get more views no she says Jeez. if i don't have 15 views on each video to just stay I'm, home. I'm going to laugh my ass off. You get fucking stocking stuff or you get some views in there. Smash that the like and subscribe button. Hit that <laughs> bell for the notifications. That's all I want for Christmas. Notifications? I'll notify you. <laughs> Add us on YouTube. I'll let you know. <laughs> Listen to us wherever you get podcast from he talks about to throw up <laughs> <laughs> your dog doesn't even like this show he wants to puke <laughs> that's, that's a perfect way to end it thanks buddy let's end it remember to go follow Stewie the swallow chug. that shit and don't Stewie microwave your food guys than you. not safe for Jeff for Frankie I am Sean thanks for listening <laughs> Come back next oh. week where maybe oh, we'll have music? we'll have intro <laughs> and outro You're music. Done. Until then <laughs> Thanks for listening. <sighs> and go to shop.spreadshirt.com backslash the hyphen gentleman's hyphen den for all your gentlemen's den merch needs. You know it'd be cool if we saw someone else besides us wearing our shirts. Buy a shirt so I can show my face around my mother at Christmas. Yes. Make make our parents proud of us. Make our parents proud of us because we suck. (laughs) See you next week, guys. guys I'm good.